All right, hey y'all, I got a couple of channelings really quick. Um, I was channeling, and I channeled this a couple weeks ago. I was channeling the Players Club, but I, I was um, hearing specifically um, St. Louis. He said, do something to make me feel better. It, I, I just kept on hearing it today, so it's like... Some sort of big boss that nobody ever sees or something like that. Because y'all know nobody ever really seen St. Louis. He was always like rolling his window down. It's like when he got angry, he called them people up or these people, whoever. And they had to do something to make him feel better. Like whatever the case may be. So somebody could own a club or somebody could work at a strip club. Um, Somebody could owe somebody money. It's something like that. Um, and this guy wants to feel better. He's like, do something to take take whatever I'm feeling off of me. I was also um hearing is that um I was also getting um I forget what movie that was. I don't know if it was Big Mama's house or it was Blue Streak, but it was when two guys was in a cell and um he said, Did he put his hands on you? He said like this like this it was something like that um but i wasn't getting is two men it's a masculine who suffers severe mothering issues so he's been going to different feminines and he's like telling them like what a girl did or he does this all the time this is the like yeah like look the three of swords he tells people his heart is broke and you know, he acts like he's looking for direction, but he's really looking for sex. Queen of sex and stability. Queen of Wands in reverse with the Queen of Pentacles. Low vibe and feminines. Um, who could own businesses or got bank or something like that. Take it as resonates. But yeah, he, he's like going around looking for a sob story. And he got women um, attacking a woman or women attacking women. This is what he's known for. He ain't never really getting no nurturing from his mom. So, <clears throat> he's basically going around telling people, um, you know, a, a specific feminine has broke his heart. This is how he believes, like, you know, that's putting work into a relationship, him discussing his past to see how the next feminine could accommodate him. Or, um, he, he's sick, all right, whoever this masculine is. This could be a Libra. Okay, we got the justice card. Doesn't have to be. But yeah, she did this to me and she cheated on me and she did this. And what? You such a good man. She did this to you and he's full of shit. Give me something here for the um justice card. Seven of Cups in reverse. And he's being found out to be full of shit too. We got the Seven of Cups in reverse. Um, How he's knowing that something's not working anymore is because of the karma that he's receiving in his life. I feel like before it was working, but with the two of wands here and the three of pentacles in reverse, it's like people are making a decision to walk away or uh, they, they like, it's, they, somebody's like realizing it's truly something wrong with this boy. I mean, a boy, this is not even a man. Ten of cups, this could be somebody in your family. King of Pentacles in reverse, Earth sign, masculine, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, um, or the head of a family or something like that. The three of swords, or he lost a family, or this was your ex-husband. Maybe you got <clears throat> divorced from this masculine, or this don't even have to be, you know, this could be anybody. We got high honor. Yeah, he lied on the wrong person this time. A mature woman. Yeah, hey, you know, you could be older than this man or it doesn't have to be or you something just didn't work out because somebody's too mature here. Somebody's high honor and mature and somebody else is like um, trying to victimize themselves. This is like somebody who don't want to take accountability or work on themselves. Somebody in poverty or with an impoverished state of mind or this is somebody who your energy wasn't conducive with. You couldn't conceive with this person. This person... Um, it looks for high honor people to seek out to to get to get taken care of here. Thirty seven or twenty five could be significant. This is a user, all right. And we got message, and then we got jail, uh, imprisonment, and and sudden wealth. So I don't know what's going on here. Um, somebody could be getting some sort of message here uh, about something. <clears throat>
sure if this could be a Leo. With the death card in reverse, somebody's like really struggling with changing here. It's something to do with a change. This could just be responsibility. This could be accountability. This is like anything of the sort. Somebody is having a hard time changing something about their faulty uh, way of thinking. All right. Somebody here like doesn't want to be ripped away from a family or. Shrimp speaks about courage, bravery. <clears throat> yeah, we got run with the wolves, literally. This this is a leader. Um, Run with the Wolves is all about being surrounded around people who you've ascended from. Um, so this is somebody here who wants to lead you or they want to have some sort of control. But it's control is to put you in a pit of hell or destruction or something like that. All right. You could have walked away from this person or something like that. But the run with the wolves is somebody who wants to lead but isn't capable of leading. Somebody wants to lead you or... Yeah, you could have sacrificed this person or you stopped dealing with this person. Or... Okay. It's too many keep popping out. But somebody definitely has a very low self-esteem here. Somebody's been trying to end yours. All right. We got um, inner healer. Right. So, yeah, this is like... Um... This is somebody who comes to you with problems. You give them solutions, but they want to be the solution. It's something like that. Somebody's full of problems, but wants to be the solution. Give me one next to the strength. Give me one next to the strength. Now, somebody could have recently just gotten out of jail or something like that. <clears throat> King of Cups in reverse. Give me one for the strength. King of Swords in reverse. Yeah, so somebody is pissed off right now with this hermit. I don't know what they're finding out, or it's like somebody's like, shut up, don't say that. King of Swords, because the King of Swords in reverse is like somebody rude, but it's also somebody like, um, it, I didn't clarify it. Well, give me something for the strength with the King of Swords in reverse, because, you know, he could be very aggressive at this time here. It's something he has to be brave about, but... Let's see. Give me something for the King of Swords in reverse. King of Swords in reverse. King of Swords in reverse. Yeah, if you a healer and you was around this person, you're not around this person anymore or something like that. Or you feel like every time you leave this person or you're around this person, you got to heal yourself. It's something here, all right? Okay, so he's communicating to a group at this time. The Three of Pentacles, or he's the leader of a team, of a group. He could be like a leader, a team leader. He's getting really nasty with somebody here in this Three of Pentacles. What's this uh what's this Three of Pentacles here? Too many. What's this three? Give me something here for this Three of Pentacles. Give me something here. Just one card, please, spirit for the Three of Pentacles. What's this here for the Three of Pentacles? I feel like people have found out, or these women, these Seven of Cups, he could have families with some of these people here, Seven of Cups, in reverse with the Ten of Cups. But um, these women, yeah, we got the Two of Wands. He's telling them, you got to do this. Somebody's, like, giving an order. Somebody's, like, telling somebody here. I feel like somebody said something. This would be a situation where somebody told somebody something about you. 
And they could even come back and say, you know what? I made it up. Just just leave it alone. No. Uh-uh. You, you told me this person did this to you. I'm going to take care of that person. They shouldn't have X, Y, and Z. This is one of them. So he's telling somebody, like, to stand down or don't do something. He know he's been found out with the Seven of Cups in reverse. So he really don't know what to do right now. All right. Give me um just one card, please, for this Two of Wands in reverse with the Three of Pentacles. Give me one card, please, for the two of wands with the three of pentacles. Two of wands with the three of pentacles, please. Just one card, please, with the two of wands and the three of pentacles. He know they've been found out. He should. That's the nine of wands right there. He knows something. They've been found out or something's heard about. Something's been spoken about. Let's take these two. Yep. Look, we got the temperance with the nine of wands. He's telling somebody to stop. Like, um, you know, we've been caught. So somebody knows something's divine intervention. Somebody know they, they spooked. I don't know, like, when this person looks at you, like, what do they see? But it's like, you know, what are you or who are you or how do you know that? It's like some sort of... Uh, this person is wounded. They've been getting their ass kicked spiritually. Wounded, okay? Seven of Cups. What's the illusion that came out here? <clears throat> What's the illusion? What, what is this here? This Seven of Cups reverse. What's this here? These illusions shattering. What is this, please, here, ancestors? Something to do with your confidence. Ninety cups with the ten of wands. Somebody could have been saying like you're insecure, um, you're young minded, you're dumb. It's, it's something somebody like been saying here with the knight of cups to the ten of wands. It's like this person's so childish. Um, they don't have sex with me for pinnacles or they're broke. They don't give me anything or they took everything from me. I don't have anything. It's something. Yeah, Knight of Pentacles in reverse. Nothing I ever had or everything I worked for. Nothing was consistent. You know, this person took everything from me. I lost my family because of this person. X, Y, and Z. It's like a story he's been telling groups of people. Like, this is a karmic ass man who's been doing this. And I'm hearing he does this. He does this all the time. Like, he's found out, though. Mm. He's sitting here saying no direction he takes in life works because you're always an interference or something like that. And people are starting to look at this masculine's life. He's blocked. Seven of Wands with the sun. It's like, stop it. You're trying to block this feminine's happiness. Three of Swords with the three of Wands reverse. What it is, is, is that you stuck on this person. And the thing about it is, is you watching this person succeed or excel. And you felt like you were karma in her life. Like you could determine her fate and things of that nature. You in this group that you're working with. And you know that you can't. Four of wands with the six of wands. You're rejected. Whoever this masculine is that's doing this, we pray that every plan, plot, or interference that he plans for this feminine's uh, life or her life path, her journey, her success, her career, her home, we ask that every evil thought, every evil action, anything that he's intending amongst this feminine's life is immediately blocked banish and return to sender yep it's all about this relationship that somebody's gonna have with this water sign uh pisces cancer scorpio somebody like her you know somebody's gonna have a beautiful domestic life with the six of wands i don't know if you got a public platform or you're plastered somewhere or whoever this king of cups is looks at you in very high regards. Yeah, page of wands. This person has nothing but good things to say about you. And whoever this hater is, this king of swords in reverse, this person didn't like what this person had to say um, about you. So he tried to ruin you. Yeah, death. End you 
and your healing abilities in you more than likely just all together here all right somebody went through a major transformation here with this inner healer with the death card and somebody else don't like it all right let me just get one more and we're gonna go ahead and close this out here he like gains sympathy for women he's one of them like the the attention seeker type or the validative he, he needs validation or something like that all right spirit says accept your gifts yep he a happiness hater Happiness and failure. He's a happiness hater, all right? A, a, a soulless, lost individual, all right? Yep, that was true colors. Psycho, we got not happy. He could have been saying that you're a psycho. He's being found out or looked at as the psycho. Could be dealing with legal matters. Or this is what he's worried about. We got happy single. He, he's single or something. He's acting like he's happy. He's really not. He is. He's a sex addict or something. It's like everything that he said about you is treating him. And you rejected this masculine. Whoever this person is here. And after you rejected him, he went on some sort of campaign telling people all these lies about you, these women, because he has mother issues that he does not um, care to express. This would be the type that uplifts and praises um, his mother, who could have possibly been abusive or something like that. We got stingy, selfish, arrogant, insecure, waste of time. And look, he see, he's somebody could be a high-ranking spiritualist out here. Somebody rejects your information, or they did. They're sad, embarrassed, and remorseful. Okay. Yeah, he rejected your healing energy. I also see something here about trial. All right. Or somebody could be codependent on a spiritualist in regards to trial. Somebody who's arrogant to you, right? Also see a payment coming soon. Okay, we have Aquarius. I cry at night. Wishing you would come back to me. We got don't let the hater stop you. Okay. Sit, standing in truth and own it. Initial C. We got what's your fantasy? Darkest fantasy. Somebody's remorseful. Initial Q. Okay. We got water boy. Doesn't think for himself. Sh shallow. Okay. Follow your heart dreams. We have mirror meditations. Affirmations. Pure hearts. I think I can. I will. And we have something here about security cameras. Okay. Beautiful liar. Something somebody said or did or whatever the case may be. Something's on a security camera. Somebody may have been trying to lie about something. They on a security camera or something like that. So I'm going to go ahead and leave it there. So just be careful, guys. There's a masculine out there. He um he just deals with mothering issues. And when he feels as though a feminine has hurt him or done whatever, he like runs the different feminines um to... uh to make him uh, feel better. This is my very insecure, um, low self-esteem. I'm hearing a short attention span. Okay, we have passion and purpose and we have sadness and anger. So if you were spiritualist here, um, somebody is sick that you can draw feeling out of them because we seen soul loss. Somebody normally doesn't feel you draw feeling out of this person. So it, it causes um, sadness or it causes anger first, then sadness. Somebody don't know what to do. All right, let's close this out. We're going to get one of these here. One oracle. Get one oracle. One oracle, please. Let go of guilt. When you allow your light to shine brightly, you inspire others. Forgive yourself for what you think you've done or not done. And trust that God loves you unconditionally for who you are. Learn and grow from the past mistakes. And instead of berating yourself for them, berating yourself for them. Yeah. Okay. So um, take what resonates, you guys. Take care.